And welcome back. My next guest's weight gain turned into heartbreak when the love of his life suddenly ended their relationship. To build his confidence back, he decided to transform his body. Joining me via Skype with his amazing weight loss story from E's Revenge Body with Khloe Kardashian is Will Antiveros. Hi, Will. How are you? Hey, how's it going? Thanks um, for having me. Oh, no pleasure. It's, it's, a, it's, it's an honor to have you on TV, really. Thank you. Good. Wow, <laughs> All right, so let's get right to it. Now, I understand that uh, you know, you're working uh, with E and with Khloe Kardashian. How has that experience changed your life? I mean, it's completely changed my life. I uh, was very overweight and sad to start with. And since meeting Chloe, I was given all these tools and people to help me completely change my life, mind, body, and soul. And I think when you think of a weight loss show, you think it's entirely going to be about your body and transforming, but it changed every aspect of my life. Um, in fact, I was connected to my trainer Gunner through her, and now Gunner and I are like family friends. I work for him. We see each other regularly. It's been amazing. So what are some tips or some products that have helped you lose uh, your weight? I think um, if you're severely overweight and you're trying to lose weight, you see results quicker just because it's easier to lose that massive amount of fat or whatever you're trying to achieve. But then there's this point where you kind of plateau. And I feel like everybody gets to that level or you're trying to just maintain. And so I um, got in touch with a company called Nutritional Brands who uh, provides like the highest quality protein. And I think for me that was a big thing because I want to get mass and muscle, but I still want to kind of maintain weight loss. And so there's a lot of different products for protein out there and they happen to be one of the best that kind of does both. So um, I use their protein and I suggest that above any other standard just because it's higher quality. Um, and then I suffer from anxiety okay. and I always wanted a, a pre-workout that didn't have that stimulant. Mm -hmm. I want to still feel like I'm getting my workout in but I don't want to be like kind of like all over the place. And so they also have um, a stimulant free kind of like pre-workout that I've been using to help you kind of like elevate your gym, mm. you know? So, Will, let me ask you something. I, I know that this happened because you broke up, or actually the breakup from, from, from your relationship. I wish I was the one who broke up with him. Yeah, uh, and, it must have, and it must have felt horrible, but how, do you, how did you overcome that? I know that it had to be, there had to be a time when you're like, you were depressed and maybe you didn't feel too good about yourself. What, what got you out of that? Um, I think <clears throat> for me, it's different for everybody, but I think going through such pain um, actually was good for me. I think the best thing that ever happened to me was actually him leaving me. Um, I think everybody copes with pain and challenges in their life differently, and I enjoyed kind of going through that suffering, and I know that sounds really weird, but I think you can kind of take your pain and all your sorrows and turn them into gains. And um, it took me a while, and I will be honest, without the show, I don't even want to know where I'd be. But I think since I was given such a platform and such an opportunity that the normal person doesn't get to have after like a severe breakup, it's kind of my job now to help other people get out of that pain. So I think a lot of times that revenge body, I think it's a hard word to kind of deal with revenge. I don't want revenge on him or anybody. I think it was just more of a way to distract yourself and turn your biggest asset, which is your health and your body, right. into something out of pain. Right. So so we have about a minute left, Will, but I want to just see <laughs> if it can uh, maybe get you to reveal some of the, uh, the the shows that are coming with Chloe. Can you tell us anything about what's coming up with Chloe or? Um, well, I know that they were renewed for a season two of Revenge Body, which is really exciting. Um, I can't say too much about it, but um, mm -hmm. I, I think that a new batch of people are about to have an amazing experience. And Chloe is the best mentor, right. um, in my opinion, when it comes to like getting over something like a heartbreak or something traumatic in your life. I think um, 
she has this stigma of being like a Kardashian that's so glam, but she's like so real and so genuine and she really takes her time and, and her energy in, invested into these people and I'm an example of that. And so she's working on season two. I'm excited to see the new batch of people and um, I know that's what she's got going on right now. Right. All right, well, we'll think we're, um, unfortunately, we're out of time, but I wanted to really thank you for being on the show. You're an inspiration to many, and I hope everything just works out for you, okay? Please keep in touch. Thank you so much. All right, take care. All right, guys, still to come, yogurt, salads, frozen turkey, burgers, all seem good for you, but could they be hindering your weight loss? Hmm. Find out next when Healthy Lifestyle returns in just a moment.